I'm gonna start this because I want to get some explosion. I'm gonna say Shalom, all praises to you. How about some of y'all? Shy about some of We out here, Columbus, Ohio. They out here with the cannons. I'm gonna get my boy, I'll get my dude on camera just so in case. They out here with the uh, cannons. Kind of hard to see from this angle. Just in case y'all hear some explosions. That was a good one. I think I messed up the shot. That's all right. Little explosions. Right, that ain't, that's just a little cannon. That's what I was telling you. Could you imagine in the Civil War, they had lines in them motherfuckers shooting them once? Good God. Lines of fleet, uh, platoons of fleet. Uh, on that battle shit. They shoot day cannons off. No? Be on that battle shit when they shoot day cannons off. Yeah, yeah. That's some big shit on the battleships, mm -hmm. the warships. Oh ships. boy, them the artillery, the guns they got. Yeah. That motherfucker gun to hit you from 20 miles away. Yeah, yeah. That's what them faggots do. They shoot 20 miles away. Yeah. <laughs> they gonna hear weapons, ammunition. They got plutonium in it going off. Plutonium. Plutonium and shit. Shit that's used in nuclear fucking bombs. They got regular bullets with plutonium. Uranium. Yeah, uranium. I, really felt, I was still around. Uranium. Oh, Trust me, I felt that in my chest when they oh, fired that out. Oh my god. bro. I'm gonna hear a lot more of that shit going on. <laughs> oh yeah, I know. This place is about to go down. That ain't shit. That's just giving y'all a little treat for what's to fucking come. Your bloodthirsty, fake ass, hypocritical ass Americans. <laughs> Why they all fucking have this shit? They is some bloodthirsty. Everybody was blooded in love with their guns, ain't they? Bloodthirsty. Bloodthirsty. That's a trip, man. Motherfuckers obsessed with guns and death. Uh, Isaiah 24. And we started uh, 24, it says, we started three, it says, the land shall utterly empty and utterly spoil, for Yahweh has spoken this word. The earth mourneth and fadeth away, the world languisheth and fadeth away. The haughty people of the earth do languish. The earth is also defiled under the habitants thereof, because they have transgressed the laws, changed the ordinance, broken the everlasting covenant. Yeah, they, they changed all the ordinances. That's why everything in the scriptures like well first of all what does the first commandment say it says this should only you can only have one god there's only one god you're supposed to love the lord that god with all that heart with all that mind with all their soul but america you know the church is saying getting a 501 c3 tax status right the church, fuck the church of satan i don't know why they revisiting that shit. they already have so you can actually be a devil worshiper and get government assistance you know, that's a result of why they just don't come out again. These people ain't really up to what's going on. Uh, you know what I'm saying? These people ain't really up to what's going on. They ain't really paying attention to what's going on. They ain't nothing they serious. Ain't fucking Satan, that church had the seal C3. 501 C3 for years, man. It's just now seeing and just saying, oh shit, this is fucking new. Let me report this. Stupid so there's no, no coincidence you can homosexuals, you get married. You see the celebration when they was like, when they got their C3, the tax exempt, how they were celebrating. Yeah. Man, I ain't no Satanist can look that different many different ways, man. Yeah. <laughs> they look like ordinary people, right? Nah, them motherfuckers are made up in all kind of oh, shit. Oh, you talking about the weirdo shit. All kind like, of shit, different demons. But I'm saying you got a lot of, uh, but right, next door people, neighborhood. Yeah. Ordinary people, right. I got the book that's called, um, your neighbor next door is a book of psychology. Oh, shit. <laughs> and it's yeah. talking about how a serial killer is a, a, a intelligent, sometimes handsome. <laughs> you know what I mean? What about that family? They just they just now got convicted. They got put like 27 years in prison. They had their children chained up for like 20 years. Yo! They had like five kids or something. They was all chained up. Slavery. Na the neighbors didn't even know they had kids. They kept one of them chained up in slavery to <laughs> Until his 20s. That's fucked up. Their own kids. They was only allowed to take a shower like once a year. They just look like your normal next door neighbor. Doing some weirdo shit. 
gonna skip down. I'm gonna read this part. But, you know, it's uh, let's get down to verse 19. It says, uh, my God, 18. It says, no, yeah, 19. It says, the earth is utterly broken down. The earth is clean dissolved. The earth is moved exceedingly. Ooh, man, what's gonna cause that moving exceedingly? Oh yeah, that's that. Uh, your boy said I can feel that in my chest. Right. Mm -hmm. Thermo fucking nuclear fucking missiles. What do you think? Yeah. What do you think a fucking nuke is gonna do? Bro, you feel that from like one nuke, you can probably feel, you know, a, a state away. You know what I mean? That'll cause earthquakes. Yeah, so no, yeah, it definitely causes a tsunami. That's what they was fearing. They said Russia could uh, just nuke the Atlantic and uh, cause massive flooding. Yeah, they got that massive, uh, that massive uh, drone nuke. That nuke, it's an actual fucking it's a nuke. It's a drone nuke, cause it's fucking safe. <laughs> That'd be beautiful. Man. You see how big it is? Like, that make that Sar Bomba look little as hell, man. That Sar Bomba was from what, the 60s? Yeah. It was a 50 mega. They reduced it down to 100. It was a really, which was you to release 100. Is it mega or killer? Yeah. Wait a minute, which one is bigger, killer or mega? Mega. Mega's bigger. <laughs> killer. Kilo. There goes kilos. That's just like a computer. Imagine. Kilo come first. Kilo That's come crazy. First. Looking at the scale of one megaton and what it consists of, the weight and size. One. God. It's just amazing. But did you look at the size of that 50 megaton of the Russian Mexico? Man, that's Sar Obama, boy. You look at that Sar Obama, you whew. That's dreadful, man. That, they that, said it shattered windows from light. Let me just read about that moment. Shit, that looks like hell when talking about someone talking about hell. You got a hell with that looks like hell. That's a real hell. And you can see that's what the scripture is talking about by hell. I'm talking about that that fire. Can you imagine being in the middle of that fire? Just no, looking, no, I can't imagine. Just looking for a minute. No, I'm, I'm trying to look down on it. You say like <laughs> these people that get destroyed, they get destroyed, they actually gonna see the, that fire for a second. They sure are. Why they in the midst of it? Yeah, they're gonna be seeing it. Yeah, why their eyes is melting away, but they still gonna see it. Oh shit. You know, that is a beautiful sight. Are they shutting down, bro? Come on, man. I want more cannons. Uh, we got enough. It says, uh, uh, let me see. The earth shall reel to and fro like a drunken, and it shall be removed like a cottage, and the transgression of the earth shall be heavy upon it, and it shall fall and not rise again. Oh, yeah, when America falls, it ain't gonna rise again. And they're talking about, oh, we're gonna rebuild America from the noose. You know how like you said they always want to rebuild and make something great again. Nope. So when America gets destroyed, that's it. There ain't gonna be no America rising about the ashes like a phoenix. It's over. Phoenix, that comes from the Canaanite mythology. It says the Bane meter results and other data suggest the bomb yielded about 58 megatons. 58, that's the SAR bomber, right? Yeah. Just for the camera, they said the SAR bomber was 58 megatons. The blast. Does it say what the... They probably measured it at 50 when they made it, but the blast itself was far more exceeding. <laughs> I love that sound. I wonder, like, does it say how big the new ones are? No. 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 Because that motherfucking new, that, that sub drone, man, that's ma that was a massive ass thing, man. It's massive as hell. And it's made to continuously keep going, circling and moving, man, without, you know, much maintenance. They said drone, though, you said? Yeah, because they got it. They make, you make. I actually just did it last week. They released a new sub that carried the actual drones. And that's crazy, a sub that's carrying them drones, nuke drones, man. It's an unmanned nuke drone. And the sub itself is massive, man. It's, ooh, I love watching that nuke, that Russian technology, man. That shit crazy. How, how they build that shit is crazy. It's just mind boggling. Like, he's gonna talk, that's the Lord. That's the, he's gonna talk about the spirit of the Lord getting in these devils to make shit, man. That's all that is, man. It's just the spirit of the Lord. It ain't them. 
And what the world look, oh, that's a key. That's why motherfuckers are stuck and stupid when it comes to this goddamn devil. Because they seeing what all the shit he's doing. Not even knowing that it's the Lord doing it, really. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, dumbasses. Reports on neighboring cities, not neighboring cities, but people that were like 60, 100, 120. I should have fucking saved them, my dumb ass did. And they were all giving reports on how windows were shattering like about 120 miles away. Damn. And you know, that's Cleveland. <laughs> you know? It's the Rock 20 and uh, it's our 13 and 12. Justice shall be blotted out. The true, true dealing shall endure forever. The goods of the unjust shall be dried up like a river and shall vanish with noise like a great thunder and rain. The noise. Yeah, it goes. <laughs> it's going to vanish with great thunder and noise. They getting happy. They got all happy. You went off on the field of the chest. Ain't all happy and shit. Stupid. It says the Sar Bomba, however, differs from his parent design, the RN202, in a number of places. I think that's safe. Martin. The SAR bomber was a three-stage bomb with the Trutnif Mavith, second and third stage design, with a yield of 50 megatons. This is equivalent to about 1,570 times, and it just disappeared. Here it is. It's about that good. Okay. 1,570 1, times the combined energy of the bombs that destroyed Hiroshima and yeah. Nagasaki. They had a bomb that destroyed the whole city, the bomb they had. So, so they got they got a bomb that could potentially would destroy a thousand cities. <laughs> Put that in right, picture it. You know what is what the Bible always say when you read these scriptures? Try and visualize it. Yeah. Try and visualize it. 1,570 times the combined energy of the bombs that destroyed Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Ten times the combined energy of all the conventional explosives used in World War II. Damn. That's a long bomb. <laughs> so you know they've been saving them bombs. They're going to use them. Hey, they used them motherfucking bombs uh, on Hiroshima, didn't they? Hell <laughs> yeah. And now they got better bombs? You... Come on, man. Far better, man. Far you know better. They... They all gonna get used. Back then, the Russians probably never envisioned them shooting nukes that maneuver. No. You know, they never, they probably never envisioned that. But as they gradually got their big head, they probably just started there has to crazy, be, man. There gotta be a day where they use the nukes. There gotta be. That's the day. That's the day of reckoning. The day, the day when the Lord will crack them stars. That's crazy. Personally, I believe they're gonna use the tactical ones for themselves. I think they're gonna use some big boys from the Lord. Man. You know, that's personally what I think. I personally see that. Yeah. I mean, come on, how else they gonna destroy the Lord one on one? Come on, square up, nigga. They go. You know shoot, what I'm saying? Shoot missiles <laughs> at, at the chariot. Right. The Lord. They know that these devils know. The Lord said, um, uh, I, 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 "You will not meet me as a fucking man, as a man." Yep. I say, "Fuck it." I'm just in. Yeah. You know. uh, that's all good. That's in just, the fiery spirit. <laughs> hey, look, I can, let me get that scripture real quick. This is you mentioned it. So they gotta fight the Lord with. With, with massive power, with massive manpower, massive firepower, massive firepower. He said when they turned their counselors to look, they you know when they said that, but they durst fight. And what does what's that? Uh, let me just get it. Oh yeah. Second answer. Yeah. Second answer. Is that thirteen. I want to read this part real quick. It's that war in heaven in Revelation. Revelation twelve and seven. There is a war in heaven, and Michael and his angels fought against a dragon and the dragon fought in his and his angels did the angel just mean messenger anyway but that's like their troops could they go could the lord and the angels that's michael the angels plus the lord gonna be with him he's fighting against the dragon the dragon is the roman empire which is reincarnated as the united states that's a fact america yeah america America, the dragon. Everything about the Roman Empire is just, just a mirror image, man. It's just yeah. a different fucking time period. You know, all scholars are going to say, Bible scholars, they know that the dragon, that great red dragon is Rome. Right. Rome was a fucking concrete empire. Yeah. <laughs> right, just right. saying concrete. They got a Roman temple back here. Right. 
Uh, they said, and they prevailed not, neither was their place found any more in heaven. When they say prevailed not, that means y'all got your ass whooped. They gonna get the ass whooped. Y'all got a little spiritual ass whooping. Literally, y'all got a spiritual ass whooping. <laughs> Shit. And that great dragon cast, was cast out the old serpent called the devil and Satan. Ooh, Esau? Yeah, that's talking about Esau. Ooh, Esau? That's why he's a great red dragon. The devil and Satan. Which deceived the whole world. Because who's deceiving the whole world? I'm God. Here. I'm God. Right, that's, they deceived the whole world. Uh... He was cast out into the earth and his angels were cast out with him. Now I heard a loud voice in heaven. Now is come salvation and strength in the kingdom of the Most High and the power of Yahweh Shai for the accuser of our brethren is cast down, which accused him uh, before our power day and night. And, oh, real quick though. But this proves that this hasn't happened yet because some people try to say, that's talking about fallen angels. But it tells you that after Satan's cast out of the heaven and destroyed and his angel, that's when we're going to be in the kingdom. That's how we know this is a future prophecy. Go ahead. Uh, 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 you can see the whole world. The way you can see the whole world is telling people that aliens or whatever chariots are. Oh, yeah. Yeah, aliens. I was talking about that. You were talking about that discussion at work. Uh, you believe this uh, life form from different and shit. They, they, they saw try to say, well, yeah, we found life for a life, a life source, whatever, and some planets. And some, they said, some dude told me at work, he said some dude went on a uh, uh, YouTube Live and looked up Mars, he zoomed in and found a base. Some dumb ass shit. Like, come on, son. <laughs> come on, son. There's a whole lot of that's coming out now, too. Like, they saying they seeing something moving in Mars, too, underground. Yeah. They see something moving up. Like, oh, fuck, and people eat that shit up, man. The pyramid on Mars? It's crazy. I know you see what, what's Pyramid, that called? The face. It's called Caledonia. Is that the face? A, it's the whole region on Mars. But I used to be heavy Caledonia. into that shit. Caledonia. That it's the like region. Some shit. Yeah, I gotta look it up. Caledonia. Say yo, which area? Which area you said? Probably Caledonia. See, 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 see how they trying to uh, what's that called? That uh, they trying to use that propaganda to get the So when the Lord does appear. Nobody wants to, nobody wants to, uh, you know, receive it. Everybody, fuck that, it's an alien. That's it. Exactly. That's, that's why it's all these cartoons and movies that the number one threat to aliens. You know what I'm saying? You know, the average person, they believe in aliens now more than they believe in the Lord. They, they believe in that. A lot of people that that Anunnaki shit. Where you boy last week? This dude came out here last week, bugged out of his mind. Talking about the earth was flat. Talking about the fallen angels or aliens or some crazy shit. They always want to say, oh, the aliens came and they took the lower hominids, the apes, and they mixed their D uh, the alien DNA with the monkey DNA. And that's where humans come from. <laughs> and they, they believe that shit. Yeah, they tripping. They all tripping. <laughs> you said look it up on what again? Uh, which area? I don't which know. Which area? Caledonia. That's where I sound like. so-called top expert in the Mars and the pyramids on Mars. He's pretty much a little douchebag. C-A-L. What's up, bro? How you doing? C-A-L, you said? C-A-L-D-O-N. Cool. I think. I'm trying to wild goose shape. Cool. Hey, it gotta be something. Oh, you know, I heard another thing too, man. Blue. Tell you how people bug out Jake is. Now that I heard people saying, oh, the Egypt in the Bible is actually talking about Mars. And, and the, and the Exodus is the Exodus is when they came to Earth today to escape from Mars. 
a bunch of motherfucking shit assembled with an assassin. That's some funny shit, man. That's crazy. That was the extra. Man. It remind me of uh, what is that? What's that movie? That's a good movie that uh, from the comic book that John Carter. You seen that shit? John Carter go it goes to Mars or something. People bugged out, man. Somebody directed uh, Boys in the Hood about to be put to death. Who? The last support. Really directed at Boys in the Hood. Like, John Singletary? Dude, John Singleton? Singleton? Something like that. Dude, they got yeah, a Yeah, Singletary? Tupac. Yeah, he got, he got beat up by Tupac, didn't he? So, I can't imagine Tupac beating anybody. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? For real. <laughs> For real. Yeah. Yeah. John Singleton was a, wasn't a little nigga. He sued Tupac a one. Yeah, sure was. Yeah, I said three, one and five it says as birds flying, so when Yahweh of hosts defend Jerusalem, defending also he will deliver it and pass it over, he will preserve it. You see like the birds have like a little formation and shit. Some you know, some chairs might see me in that same formation. Yeah. Right, there's a formation to reduce drag. So the, the birds behind you, the, behind that drag, that dra the drag is a, a pocket of air that you can be in. It. Whatever's in front is splitting it. And it's for those birds to rest. So they, they, they intelligent creatures are intelligent, but they, they even rotate. You know, they rotate. Yeah. After so long, one, another bird goes in place. That's just intelligent, man. And, and, and Jake don't even act like that. Jake don't even, you know, you know don't consider his brother. Hell no. Least bit. Just think about how he's gonna rob his brother. How he's gonna rob you. How he's gonna fuck your bitch. Yeah. Those are the baddest, some of the baddest things I've ever seen in nature, man. The devil hit the lion, the female lion, no, the male lion hit the female male lion with the dart. The female turned around and pulls the dart out. Immediately. Immediately pulls it out. Now, you seeing people get fucked up out here, somebody get broke or hurt. The first thing somebody's doing, busting out their phone. They're like, ah, I got you on camera, you got stolen. They're like, ah, you got fucked up. No, laughing at people. Somebody get in a fight, everybody wanna get on camera, you know what I mean? Nobody, nobody ain't nobody trying to help nobody. They just trying to make fun of you. That's, a, that's fucked up, man. Hey, they deserve to be made fun of too, though, so. You remember when we leave the camp on campus with a couple of black people and white people? White girl, yeah. two dorky people, them, they fell flat on their face. Yeah. They was walking in front of us too. That shit was funny. We had a bunch of people get fucked yeah. up in front of us. But they fell flat on their face like how? Like what? Like, the like, angel got them like yep. that. I seen one day this most we was down there teaching, somebody scoffed at us and then walked right into a pole. <laughs> right, right. The, the skateboard or the I think it might have been a skateboard. The skateboard or the uh, the, uh, the push up. I, I can't remember. Yeah, right. Got fucked up. <laughs> I'm still waiting for uh, the donut place we got kicked out of. Oh, the, uh, the Panera Bread? <laughs> I, ain't, get the hell out I of ain't never shot the Panera Bread ever. That's funny that. as fuck. <laughs> for nothing, though. We was talking about. We didn't even say nothing. I can't remember. Right? We got banned for life. <laughs> I got our picture in the fucking, uh, the break room. <laughs> <laughs> you know, what's the Scotland, a part of Scotland called Caledonia back in the day? Actually, I'll look into that probably later on. I ain't got no internet. It'll, you know what I mean? We won't get time to have some service. You got some scriptures? Shit, man. I don't know. I don't know. I
Are you getting it? Oh, I think I'm getting it. Did I get it straight? I was just looking for this heat though, bro. What's up? It's kind of funny when you're not here, you can find everything on the floor. You can find a quick, fast little hurry. From the camp, everything is slow. If you make a video, everything is slow. <laughs> everything gets confusing. You know what I mean? <laughs> you be in the middle of a video, you don't know, oh, man, do I got to abort and start over? <laughs> I keep going. Yeah, I made some videos, but I just, you just mess up so bad, bro. You just like, ah, I gotta start over. Sure. I thought he was that strong. Revelation 1, 7. It says, Behold, he cometh with clouds, and every eye shall see him. And they also was pierced him, and all kindreds of the earth shall well because of him, even so, amen. That's talking about Yahweh Shah, that's the one they call Jesus. It says, so when the Lord return to the earth, he gonna return to the earth and the clouds is coming out the heavens. And those clouds is talking about the so-called UFO. And the so-called UFOs is piloted by the Lord and the angels. Okay, not no aliens, no Anunnaki, none of this bugged out shit y'all talking about. So, I'll, what did it say though? It said all the kindreds of the earth shall well because of him. So when the Lord come back, he's bringing death. He gonna bring salvation to the elect of Israel. He gonna save one third of Israel, but two thirds are gonna get destroyed. What's all these heathens? They gonna get destroyed. What are saying ancient Hebrews? There was a clown in the That's gonna be a, that's gonna be beautiful. Yeah. It's it's right. There you go. The perfect word. But it said all. That's why I said word. all kindreds except shall well because it's, it's like it's like it's like, wail. it's like lightning and thunder. You know what I'm saying? Lightning and thunder is beautiful as fuck, but it's also terrifying. It's the same, you know, it at is the same right. Time. Exactly. Yeah. That's just the way it you is. go ahead. It is. And like right now, it's like every week down south, man. What's this channel called? MV something. He records all kind of beautiful chariots and stuff. Weather. Well, anyway. He's saying there's an unusual amount of lightning strikes when they, when they occur, man. And they said there's like thousands within minutes. They estimated like 50,000 within a 24-hour period, lightning strike. That's, That's a nice lightning storm this weekend. Well, I hope so. It says Exodus 12 and 30. It says, And Pharaoh rose up in the night, he and all his servants and all the Egyptians, and there was a great cry in Egypt, for there was not a house where there was not one dead. Man. That's where this is headed. Once Trump make that move, when Trump represent Pharaoh, man. Him and his army, the Egyptians, they say make their move, man. It's going to be a great fucking cry. <laughs> the time of Jacob's trouble that your pastor ain't warning you about. Not a pastor right. said the Lord just love everybody. Right. Yeah. Pastor ain't warning you, man. Everything's gonna be all right. <laughs> That's what they be teaching. That That's that bye bye. Every little thing is yeah. gonna be yeah. all right. Was it Bob Marley? Yeah. That's that three little birds song. No I never liked it. Uh, I am not. A I fan actually, I'm telling you, I just never was a fan of Bob Marley. I, I, don't, I, don't, I never could understand the hype of Bob Marley.